Rogers County Sheriff Scott Walton says in the early hours of Saturday morning, his deputies were called out to a party with up to 200 young people, some of whom were underage and allegedly drunk. We get our hands on a, on a bunch of kids ranging from uh, as early as 14, 15, or as young an age, you know, 14, 15 years old, uh, you know, up into their 20s. He says deputies were called out to a home off South 4194 Road in a rural area just north of Claremore after reports of gunshots being fired. Deputies found no gun and no injuries, but did find shell casings. And they say they found this man, 68-year-old Barry Burnesser, in a bedroom at the home. They say he was sat in a chair while two young people were embracing on the bed. He claimed to be watching TV, but deputies say there was nothing playing. They also say he told them around seven girls had been in the room. Certainly my belief that, you know, his twisted intentions is there to get young people there for his gratification. Deputies say liquor and beer bottles were also found at the property and Sheriff Walton says the young people had paid five dollars each to get in and had come from all over the state. Had it not been for law enforcement's intervention into this deal, uh, there would have been young people, probably carloads of young people, leaving there under the influence of who knows what and the potential for death uh, is, is, is pronounced. Another concerning thing was the demographics of where everybody came from, Purcell, Tuttle, you know, local and not local kids. So uh, I think you can thank social media for uh, invitations like this to go out. Sheriff Walton is now warning that the community knows about the social host law, that holding a party where kids are drinking is illegal. And the sheriff is also warning of the dangers of drinking and driving too. Get a clear picture of, you know, the liabilities the punishments that can come along with being a social host. Sadly, most of the time it's when something bad is happening.